Good morning everybody and welcome to another episode of Finding Our Adventure. We have a very exciting episode coming this week. We have just arrived at the Cotswold Driving Experience and today we are going to be doing some rally driving and 4x4 driving. Um, when I was 18 I just passed my driving test and I did some rally driving back then. I grew up loving rally driving and I haven't done it since so I'm really excited to be back uh, doing some rally driving today. It's going to be a great experience. Hannah's going to get in the cars as well and we're going to see who's faster. So we'll take you on inside now and show you what we're going to get up to. Are you excited for some rally driving? Yeah, I'm excited. I've never done it before. Um, it's a bit out of my comfort zone, but I'm going to give it a go. <laughs> As I said, I did some rally driving when I was younger. I'm gonna post a picture if I can find it just here to show you what it was like back then. And um, yeah, we're just sitting outside the driving experience center now and we can see the rally cars, we can see the four by fours and I'm like a kid at Christmas, I'm so excited. <laughs> you wanna drive them all. <laughs> Whereas I'm like, oh, I'm gonna crash it. <laughs> yeah, I've never done anything like, I've, not, I've never done anything like, I've never driven four by four. You've done some or, go-karting before. Yeah, and like I in, kind I did enjoy that, but I got really bad bruises from like the bolts on the chairs. Um, I like I did enjoy it, but yeah, this is that this is a problem. Sometimes I just overthink things, and I probably will enjoy it. But you are quite competitive, I, uh, though, so I think you will enjoy it. <laughs> yeah, I've got a bit of a bad hip as well, so you've got a heavy right foot though, so that might be a good. <laughs> yeah, gonna eat my dust. <laughs> Hannah's first up, she's got strapped into the car and she's about to go around a test track and do a couple of laps of that to get used to it and then I'm going to have a go and then we're going to do a couple of timed runs as well to see who's quicker. So um, wish me luck because I hope I win. Right, so basically one goes either side, that's it, that's it, yep. In there, in there. And then one at a time, look, you grab that fly belt and then pull it right down. And you make yourself nice and snug in the seat. Side. It's going to be a bit uncomfortable at the moment, I need to adjust the other side. Oh yeah. Maybe, I'll tell you what actually, Flandin. just keep that little oh, tiny yeah. bit of slack, because mm -hmm. then in a sec I'll pull it across and then we can do it. Okay. <laughs> it's a very high, that's it, you got it? That's the way, go on, go, 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 that's it, lovely. Good. A little bit of a run into second, spot on. It is a high clutch, so yeah, there you go. Alright, so down here Hannah, we're going to go around long right here. You can see the fairly obvious tracks, yeah? Yeah. That's a good guide. Except for down here, I've moved the track out a bit. So just be wary now, we're actually going to go off the line slightly. Stay left a little bit, that's it, good. Follow the tyres now, there you go. And then turning in hard right here, that's the one. Okay, straight in the wheel, good, well done. Straight up here, lovely. So Hannah's just out on the course right now behind me. She's looking like she's doing all right actually. She's got a few like little spins and stuff in at the moment, which is really great. And uh, making some mud fly up, so good first run so far. He just nips a touch tighter here. Good, and straightens up again. And straight on, lovely. And then turning it right. Similar here, nice and steady all the way around. Then at this last third, it nips in real tight. So hard right here, there you go. Good, straighten up. Oh, nearly. <laughs> Imagine these tyres are trees, yeah? Yeah. Then you won't hit them. <laughs> that's it, keep going then. Well done. All right, so that's a lap so far, okay? So a little bit more speed then. Build that speed up a bit more, go on, a bit more, 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 a bit more. Lovely, backing off a touch now, good. As you back off, you might just feel the back end feeling a little bit nervous now. Okay, as you come around, that's it, straighten the wheel quickly, hard on the gas now. Go, 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 hard on the gas, that's it, good. Backing off, turning in now, lovely, good, keep it there. Okay, straightening up, squeeze the throttle, go, go. Good, backing off, turning in, wonderful, good. Did all unpop. It was really cool. Yeah, it was like really surreal. I was just saying that I didn't feel like I was doing it. Um, but yeah, a big adrenaline rush. So yeah, I really liked it. All right, mate. Yeah, all right, mate. Yeah. You all right? Yeah. Let's do a lap reasonably steady, focusing on the track so you know where you're going. Yep. Then after that then, as soon as we come down here, we'll egg you on and chuck okay. you into some corners and see what happens. Sounds All right. good to me. Cool. And off and turn. Yes, well recovered. <laughs> well done. Back off now and turn. That's it. You got it, you got it. Good. Turn her in, mate. Well done. Turn in harder, harder, harder. Right, hard on the gas now. Straighten up. Go, go, go. Power. Good, back it off, turn in, turn in hard. That's it, well done, now on the gas, well done, lovely. And off, turn. Good, steer it through, well done, steer it in, steer it in tighter. Good, straighten up now, hard. 
really slow on the camera. Edge. So, do we? <laughs> a little bit on the edge where we knocked a tree. So, yeah, you're, you, you, you just, you're that bit neater. So, is it if we hit something, are we losing time? So, that's what I'm going to say to you now is, yeah, so what we do just to make the time run a bit more interesting, mm -hmm. imagining those tyres are trees. Yeah. Yeah, yeah when you said that, I thought, oh, I can't, I can't go outside from that. <laughs> you know I can't I mean? even Right, so we've got a challenge. Um, we're going to be doing a race between each other, but not at the same time. Um, so we're going to be doing three laps and we're going to be timed and see who's the fastest. <laughs> well, I did catch her a bit when you came out, so he said I'm a bit neater. But that's because he told me that to treat all the tyres as trees. So when he said that, I was like, oh, I can't run over any tyres. I, I thought that actually maybe like if I hit the tyre that I'd like I don't know, something would go wrong, so maybe I was like, in the mind of being like, I had to stay in the tyres, but who knows, we'll see what happens. Two mistakes you made, you probably lost 10 seconds. Really? Mm, be surprised. Mm. You'd be surprised. Because it feels like age, like when you come to that standstill, you feel like it's ages. Yeah. I feel like, so, oh, that's... You know, we could say 155, 145. Mm. See how it does. Is that right? We'll see. Yeah. No, yeah. it's really good. Excellent. Thank you. Well done. No problem at all. <laughs> so, what did you get? I got 155. And I like spun out a few times, and it, I say saying it felt like ages you, when I stopped. Did you hit a tire as well? Probably, yeah. <laughs> I, I think I've made a mess out there on the track. <laughs> They've got to go tidy it up. So yeah. Now it's your turn. Build a bit of revs. You ready then? Yep. Three, two, one, go, go. go. <laughs> Yeah. 
that's why we're letting you have one more there. But um, that was a 143. Was it? So that's very close to what Hannah. Would... I think it would have. You, you're certainly braver with your speed. It, we go down here. I'm like, go on, go on, go on, and it's like her foot just won't go any further. Yeah, she yeah. hits like a restrictor, but it might just keep her a little bit neater. Yeah. But you're dead. I mean, the male ego in you has definitely got the balls. <laughs> do you know what I mean? Like you know. So um, yeah, it's good. No, I mean there was with, with with that extra bit of tuition, you would definitely be fast. 100%. It's it's a thing. I, I can get anybody to go flat out into a corner and chuck it in. That's easy. Yeah. yeah. It's dealing with the consequences of yeah, what yeah. happens with it then. Yeah. And that's the experience, skill, ability, it's natural ability, whatever whatever it, it is really. Um, and just yeah, just refining that is it wouldn't be a difficult job for you. But cool. yeah, no fair play. We'll that was back, excellent. Yes. Thank you so much. No, that's all right. Pleasure. Seem really slow, but yeah, was, it slow. <laughs> was it? Oh no, you won. What did you know? get? So you did a 145, and yeah. in all fairness, I did say it could have been a 145, didn't I? Yeah, because yeah. Yeah. Because I went out. He had a bit of a wiggle down the bottom, a but wiggle. fairly clean run. It was a 143. <gasps> so wow. I would say, without your errors, very, pretty close. Very close. Very close oh, <laughs> Do it again. <laughs> Right, we're in the, um, is it Defender? Uh, Discovery. We're in the Discovery now, oh, and <laughs> I thought I'd check with Johnny, because Johnny knows these things. So we're gonna be doing the four by four experience now, and um, take it in turns to drive, so. And the, the track is so muddy, like already, we haven't even gone, we've only been in first and second gear, but the Land Rover's managed to get through everything so far. Yeah. But we just come across one of the other Land Rovers, and their exhaust is hanging off, so. Um, so yeah, they're, yeah, no they're pressure. <laughs> <laughs> Not sure if I wanna do it now. <laughs> This is something go. we normally teach people. Do you? Yeah, because right now, what the hell would you do? Um, yeah. I get, I'm guessing you would think you need to carry on, but you can't. You can't. So you've no. got to reverse. You have. Down Could the you hill. now? Be, bear in mind, you've just stalled it. Yeah, I have. How so on I, earth would you get into reverse gear? Don't actually do it. Talk no, me through it. Um, <laughs> I love it because people are like, I don't know. No I idea. don't know. I, right. I guess so I'd have is, to go into <clears throat> neutral turn. Or no. No. What you've got to think about is at no point do you really want to be in neutral. No. Because you Otherwise need to stay I on won't this have hill. any yeah. Yeah, and you've got to get it into drive. Okay. Right, so this is something that I'll teach you because we're in this position now. It's called a failed ascent, all right? So imagine this is a big hill and you've just done this and you've got to get back down. All right, there's mm. a there's a wrong way and a right way. The wrong way is to like neutral and just roll it back. You could get away with that here. Fine. But it's not the correct way. This hill might be two miles long and you've got to get it back safely. It could be snow, ice, whatever. Yeah. Yeah. So keeping your foot welded on that brake pedal, yep. right? That's now your handbrake. Yeah. Always keep one hand on the steering wheel. 
because in doing the maneuvers if it has a bit of a slip and a wibble and a wobble yeah it, it might start turning the wheel then yeah. you lose track of where it is okay? okay so what you need to do hopefully you're hard enough on the brake gently mm -hmm. press the clutch down and you're going to go from first into second no that's not uh, reverse sorry not second just realized <laughs> what i just said before. i did what you said yeah you did no you absolutely did yeah um it's yeah it's a slip on the gravel at this point it's kind of pointless but we'll go yeah. through it anyway okay. so now you're in in reverse now I'm okay in reverse, yeah. take your foot off the clutch mm -hmm. now take your foot off the brake so now Mm. we're effectively weird. held on the hill in reverse, in reverse. Okay. now this is the weird bit now if you put your left hand back on the steering wheel and with your right hand start it up so in theory would you not slip down the hill it might but that's your, what you don't want to do okay. okay so then you'll naturally just go back wow. up the hill right you could be uncontrolled okay stop the there with the clutch and brake there you go do you feel the torque how it was trying yeah. to pull you back up the hill as well that's how that's much grunt they've got that's crazy how much power it's got i was like whoa um, if we can, I'd like to go back up a bit more if it will hold us. Okay. So, so just, just go back. Yeah, just back up a bit more. No pressure, but they are um, people filming us behind. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah see that. <laughs> Thanks for right, telling on, me that. Bit yeah. More, bit more. Bit more. Bit more. Bit more. Bit yeah. more. Right. Hold it there. Hold it there. If it will. That's it. Right. Second gear. Right. Now from this point, you've literally clutch up, flat out. Literally, just imagine you're going just. for a rally start. Clutch up, bang it on the throttle, get us up that hill. Okay. No pressure, but as you say, they are filming. Go, 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 go. Well done. There you go. Well done, man. Excellent. Right, back into first gear before we go down the hill. I'm really driving. <laughs> <laughs> okay, come off the clutch. Can you feel now it's snaking? Yeah. What? Do you know why? Uh, your front wheels are in the, the right, your rear wheels aren't. Oh, I like that tree, by the way. Just saying. Oh. That's right, you're right now. Okay, let go of the wheel. Let go of the wheel. That's it. Happy that it's in the right place? As in, I don't mean bolted there, as in the wheels are in the... Yeah. Okay. Is that better? You sure about that? No. Straighten up quickly, mate. That's it. We're going to go right hand track. A little bit more speed. Right here? Yeah. And now straight on up the hill. Right, you're not going to get out because you know what's coming. Yeah. Right, so you've got to make this. Let's go you've straight got to, down. You've got to look damn good. So down. I want to okay. hammer it when it gets down to the bottom. Right, so steady as you go. Straighten yourself up. Happy with that? Yep. I hope so because we're going. That's it. Right, go, go, go. Go on. Power. Go, go, go. Back off a touch. A little bit, that's it, that's it. Oh, Boom. Yeah. <laughs> you can feel it when you've got to get nice. off. Mate. I'm going to say I'm proud of you, mate. That's amazing. Yeah, Thank at least you. somebody can do it. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shut up. Sorry. Totally wrecked your video. There we go. That's right. No, it's good. It's easier second time, isn't it? I'm going to watch yourself. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Right? It's, it's not. It's really not, no. <laughs> Actually, technically, the more people go over it, the harder it gets. So. Right. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, shut up. <laughs> Yeah, whatever. Take it on the chin. No, it's good. Fair play. It is though. It's 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 just it's regulating that throttle, and, yeah. that, and that's not making an excuse or anything like that. It's just having that feel for what it is, and you went into it straight in, not knowing what to expect. I definitely felt like if I just kept without yeah. lifting at the end, there it would have gone. It would have. It would have gone into wheel spin. Yeah, and that's exactly it. And you've just got some people. I like, go right, lift a little bit. And they go and it just stopped. And I, no, I didn't mean like yeah. lift off because it was know. starting to wheel spin a little bit, wasn't it? Yeah. Guys, we have just <laughs> finished an amazing day here at the Cotswold Driving Experience Centre. It has been so good. We did rally driving, which was just amazing. Mm. The first time I've done it in like more than 10 years and it was just so much fun. And then we went on to the 4x4 course um, with the Land Rovers and that was just 
an unreal experience, like taking it over all the mud. I mean, we couldn't believe <laughs> the mud that we were going through. It was so thick. I was just like, how the heck is it going to get through here? And it was yeah. just like almost gliding through. It was just amazing. Like I loved, um, I was really nervous about the rally driving, uh, but I found that it was like really good experience and just like even the instructions we were given and just like get, we were given, I felt like I was given a bit more confidence with it and like, uh, yeah. It's really hard to describe it, but we just, we, we haven't been able to stop smiling. Yeah, the team, and, the team um, here are so nice and they really do look after you very well um, and like make you feel comfortable and reassured and confident. Yeah, and the four by four driving, like going up these, vert not vertical, yeah. but like Pretty really steep, steep hills that I just didn't think I would ever do yeah. anything like that. And do really well. Oh, thanks. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, if you're in the area, in the Cotswolds, you have to come and check out the Cotswolds driving experience. It's just such a cool place to come. And yeah, 100%. You know, something that you have to do at least once in your life is come and do um, some rally driving and some 4x4 experience. Yeah, get outside your comfort zone and Absolutely. give it a go. Because Hannah was really nervous this morning, but then she couldn't stop smiling after her first run. Yeah, I'd do it again. I'd do it again. <laughs> We've just got to our park up for the evening. We've got the heater on, so it's nice and toasty and warm in here. And we've just had, as we said earlier, just such a brilliant day. But if you've enjoyed that, don't forget to give us a like and a comment down below and tell us what your favorite bit was and if you'd be brave enough to do rally driving and 4x4ing. And don't forget to subscribe and we'll see you in the next week's video. Bye.